Oh, five. somebody said it's worse. I'm the third string. Okay, fuck you too. Okay, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. Don't worry about it. Okay, I'm the third string. There We're gonna go. do what we always do, boys. Uh, uh, now they have a guest over. It's time to watch some Joe Rogan. Uh, Apparently, he got really fucking drunk. Uh, Joe Rogan got white girl wasted and ruined the comedy show. Let's take a look. We just did a five-hour podcast and we're fucking hammered. <laughs> Cheers. Woo! Cheers. Yeah, Joe, uh, I love that video. I love that video of fucking uh, uh, Tom Segura talking about how much he loves drinking. He's like, I love alcohol. <laughs> we'll look at that in a second. Yeah. One of my heroes. Suck my dick. One of my best friends. Bert, I will buy you a fucking house. Let's go. Or right, not Tom Segura, go, fucking bitch. Bert Kreischer, right? Or wait. The one sitting next to him, is that, is that, what's his name? I always fuck it, it's, it's Burt Kreischer, or they're both alcoholics? Fuck, I know, they're all, god damn it, the machine, bro, the machine. It's, yeah, it's, it's Burt Kreischer, okay, yeah, 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 not Tom Segura. Wait, hold on, do they look different from one another? I gotta look this up. Okay, so this is Burt Kreischer, right? The, the fucking, the, the man, the myth, the legend, the machine. Okay. And then this is Tom Segura. Are you fucking kidding me, bro? I mean, come on, dude. Well, how? Make a different guy. This Literally, he just looks like he is, he's more accelerated as balding. They look like the same person, except one has more accelerated balding. It's weird because like this, I can't tell them apart, but I can't also tell the, I can't, I can tell them that they're different people, but I can't tell them apart. It's weird. Like it's so, it's like different shades I know of white. You, you know what I mean? I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Like, you know, they're not the same person, but in your mind, they don't have enough differences that like, you can't be like, well, that's Tom Segura versus that's Burt Kreischer. Like you could fuck both of them up yes. in your mind. Like when you're. You could just as easily point to Tom Segura and go, that's Burt Kreischer. Or you could just as easily point to Tom Segura and be like, that's, or, or uh, po point to Burt and say, that's Tom Segura. They're just very... Burt is fat, Tom is not. Tom lost some weight, I think. I think if I knew them better, I'd be able to, um, be able to distinguish between them. Racism, racism, racism. Are we being anti-white racist right now? Wait, am I being anti-white? I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. We do would that never way. do that. We love, we we love uh, white people. We defend the white race. Americans, their health care. Give health care to the people of the U.S. Yeah. Okay. They should do health care. Tom is Latino, Latinx, sweaty. Um. Anyway, uh, uh, fucking just total random, you know, uh, moment there. But let's get back. Let's play Super Smash Brothers Melee, like religiously. Wow. Is this last night? I don't know anything about that. Yeah, yeah that's like our third We're time. surrounded by nerds! <laughs> <laughs> it is. Wow. Incredible. Oh, my God. Damn, dude. He fucking killed that, dude. So for those of you who don't know what Kill Tony is, this is, I mean, I'm sure Tony and fucking everyone else has been canceled a million times over. I don't really follow them as much anymore, but I used to watch Kill Tony all the time. Uh, it's a show where they bring up, it's a show where they bring on like comics that are just starting stand up and they make them do their like tight, they make them do their like tight five, but well, not even a tight five. They just make them do their like first ever stand up basically uh and then uh it, it's it's actually a pretty solid it's actually a pretty it's a one minute it's like a one minute stand-up that they do which is very very difficult to put together by the way like 60 seconds of like really good jokes uh or or like six seconds with the build-up and also like then uh you know punchline it's like very awkward in general but it's also really good because you will never have you will never have, uh, as a, as a stand-up that's just like just starting, you're never going to have a fucking full room 
uh especially because i used to do it in the belly room of the comedy store it's a really good room for that sort of stuff it's like small um you'll never have a full room in an audience like that and more importantly you'll never have like actual fucking legends critique your your set you know so it's actually a brilliant concept it's a really good concept i didn't even know they were still doing it so joe behaving this way is extra cringe because like you know these are people that are probably very excited to be around joe rogan because like they're literally stand-up legends yes motherfucker legends i know I, I know that you like hate comedy or whatever but uh you know the these are most of the guests on there are usually very very good like professional stand-up comics so yes it's so weird it's like i fucking love stand-up comedy me too i love stand-up comedy it's one of my favorite favorite things which is why um yeah I, I love i love it i know it's like you either love it or you hate it i feel like with stand-up they do kill tony in austin now it's different but it's still pretty cool okay anyway let's continue I should drink a gallon of whiskey today. I am and I'm not even lying. Up. It's a shocking amount of whiskey. No, Bert, no. Bert and I were singing that song in the podcast today. Drunk if, as fuck. If, <laughs> I am fucking hell. Oh my god. Look at this. These two guys. We all need guns! <laughs> I get a FaceTime call. Yeah. It's Bert and Joe, and they're like, hey, and they're shit faced, right? <laughs> William. This is Texas where America lives for real. Richard, where were you overseas exactly? I, I've been in China for a while. Oh, okay. really? Hell oh. yeah. I'm big Old school, baby. I'm real big over Learning there. kung fu and slinging dick. <laughs> <laughs> How long? Actually, that wasn't that bad. That, 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 I don't know why they fucking put that in there. That's kind of funny. Like, uh... Slinging dick in China? I mean, it's like he's I mean, he's making a sex pat joke. I mean, I don't know. I didn't laugh. Oh, oh God! Shut the fuck up. No, not because are... it was offensive. I just didn't laugh because I didn't laugh. I would laugh. Just laugh a little bit me. racist. I mean, it definitely is. But like I'm saying, he's make. It's more of a the kung fu one is like. Look, I'm not look. The I kung fu ones. It. The kung fu one is like put, insensitive. <laughs> I'm not trying to say that I didn't laugh because it was insensitive. I didn't laugh because it wasn't funny. That's all. I'm I mean, in, with respect to everything else he said so far, where he's just like drunkenly being like, ugh, ugh, we're surrounded by like, nerds. That one was like look, at I, least a joke. I can take a good that one. I can. Take that one was at joke. least like trying to be a joke. Do you know what I mean? I can take a really good I'll joke. Spend over I can get down with a really good gay joke. Just make it funny. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm down with jokes. I can be the butt of a joke, right? Just okay. Make it funny. That's all I'm saying. Um, and for the record, like Joe Rogan has never been like my favorite stand-up comic ever. He's just good at podcasts. That's it. His stand-up has always been like kind of mid. Yeah. Um, for the record, I've a, that's I've not heard. like, but but everyone knows that. Over there, like a year. Okay. Wait, what did he say? How long did you movie. spend over there? Like a year. Okay. Woo! Shout out to Ric Flair. Put up at that uh, Kill Tony. Blasted. We came in five drinks in. Five drinks in. Stop getting stuck under the bed. What the fuck is happening? Five drinks in. That's my son, you crazy bitch. <laughs> That's one funny thing. Every time you come on Kill Tony, you're blasted. Like, <laughs> yeah. I never feel like I should be sober. Like, why would yeah. I be sober here? I'm not really performing. Just right. watching. Yeah. Just let's. Show up, blasted. Yeah, <laughs> you can you can pull it off. <laughs> I only get drunk on planes. You guys know this is going on the internet, right? She's a she's a celebrity. I want to call a fucking Joe. lawyer right now. This is the uh, this is the Congress. I didn't sign anything. <laughs> Let's go, bitch. Oh, it's so bad. Oh, that's so awkward. Imagine getting fucking blast it out the ass like this and then like and then having that live on the internet forever especially because you're like literally a a famous person i hope i don't have a moment like that where i just get because i don't you know i don't really drink that much and i don't think i've ever been that drunk so i'm just afraid of what i'll act like if i'm that drunk yeah. wait why are pepe la i don't think it's gonna wait was i that drunk at shit camp 
What? Oh shit, maybe I was. You don't listen to them, don't listen to them. They're just like trying to fuck with you. <laughs> oh no, was I drunk at shit camp? Oh my god, I think. Oh, shit camp and shit con. Oh, I was. Were you? I don't remember you being fucking drunk. What did I do? I remember licking the floor. It, oh, what? I remember licking the floor. Was that when I was drinking? Um, Wait, where was that? I where did you lick the floor? I remember it, but it I was can't a remember shit where. camp. But I don't. I, look, I don't think I was that drunk, right? Like I was drinking and tipsy and feeling a buzz, but I wasn't that drunk. Anyway, I've never been that drunk. Here is uh, here's Joseph Robin at Rogan. Uh, 